<clears throat> What's the difference? We're going to get another reaction today. We're hopping into Gilmore Girls episode number six, season number six, called Welcome to the Dollhouse. Hopefully, it's a great episode. Hopefully, it's a lot of fun. Hopefully, you guys have been enjoying the series. If you have, like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Patreon for the full reaction on episodes episode if you want them. If you don't, that's totally cool. Episodes will be here on YouTube whenever they show up. So, previous episode. Previous episode, we had Rory kind of creating this whole thing for um, Emily. whole party thing. The family that shunned her was there. Richard confronted them. Emily confronted them. We'll see what comes of it. Uh, Rory's life isn't as bad as it. It's not bad. Like she, I don't know. I feel like she's, she's been. I want to say she's been so spoiled, which is why like everything is like a big deal to her right now. Or actually, it's not really a big deal to her. They're just kind of. She doesn't. She's kind of just kind of going with the flow. I guess it's a good thing on her character, but at the same time, she is like. I don't know. She, does she see the wrong? I don't know if she even sees the wrong. I don't even think she thinks she is wrong. But overall, I thought uh, last episode was pretty good. And the ending, end game of it. I didn't think the, I thought the beginning was kind of whatever and boring. But I thought the end game of it was great. So we're going to hop into this one, see where things go. It's called Welcome to the Dollhouse. That can mean things are fragile. I don't know. Here we go. Despite the disturbing sight of women in pantaloons. Oh, I hope this isn't an audience participation thing. Excuse me, but we're in the middle of something here. Who are you? It's oh my her. Gosh. I'm famous. <laughs> my brother's gonna die. We have come a long way <laughs> through space and time. We hail mm. from Stars Hollow. Andrew. Gypsy. It is. And we do not recognize you. As residents of the year 1779, all looks foreign to us. Who's going to tell them those outfits are so 1778? Why, you have sojourned from the very year of Stars Hollow's founding, Peach Street. And for Longman's Leap, but found Second Avenue. That must be very confusing. Don't Pray, tell me this. Tell me, how may we ease your passage? This whole thing better not be to get the names. To its old street names. We would more easily find our way. The no. old street names, you say? Gentlemen, do take seats while I confer with my contemporaries. No, this is so it? stupid. Shh, you're wearing tube socks. Ladies and gentlemen, our tourism <laughs> revenue is off 26% from the previous fiscal year in our future. I'll have to buy a new business card. I think it would be kind of cool. Really? Yeah, I like old-timey stuff. And dragonflies on 3rd Street, which is kind of boring. Well, thank you, Lorelai, for your sound opinion. What's, I think it's what's the original now? I agree. It's not like the time you guaranteed the tourists a mosquito-free summer and then released hundreds of bat balls. Oh, that's my favorite! Yeah, well, they start acknowledging that your ideas are mostly dumb. Feeling lonely and, and so cold. cold. Dress up as our favorite tree again for Arbor Day. Wrap me in bark, fill me with sap. Tell no me where way! To but what? He wants to Photoshop a picture of you with your arm around him and slap it on a billboard that overlooks the whole town. The river's end. You're sitting it's like you're washing your face in a bowl of diamonds. Is it Rory? A bowl of diamonds. It's Rory in the paper. Cut up your face. Uh, I need my coffee. Consuela. She's probably in the backyard harvesting sugar cane. Maybe Consuela and Logan have run off together. <laughs> it's funny. Logan's probably out of town or busy with school. All I know over there. Why did you have to go over there? Because Emily, she just had a small fire. <laughs> Why? Was she speaking? Deep conversation, unlike the one you and I are having. <laughs> Shouldn't have told me, Richard. He likes it, doesn't And she? this grapefruit is definitely sugared. What were you? Sukiya. I don't think it's a real Spanish name. I think they just added an A on the end. <laughs> okay. See? Where are we? There. Right there. That is the Lake Suki. If we were there, we would all have drowned. I can do it all. I can't find. Oh. Oh, no. What is it? Oh, no. What is it? Oh, no. What is it? What is it? Oh, no. What is it? Come on. Yeah. No, I understand Taylor's a very busy man, but it's just a quick question. What is it called? More like Gilmore. You know me, Joey. It's classy. And oh, smell it. It's got that great new car smell, except it's not a car. Oh, I love she it. doesn't know purses. I love it. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Sorry, this or not, not name, bro. Inside the bag, inside the bag, inside the box, inside the bag. It's great. You know, 
I think my computer cords will fit in. Oh, oh, I found. We're just gonna give him alcohol. Logan, you found Logan. How are you? How are you, Emily? Logan was just dropping Rory off. Or, oh, sorry. Hey, if I'm not back in five minutes, it means I'm in the main house picking out China patterns with Emily. <laughs> That's why he's annoyed. Okay. Oh, starved. You're always starved. Yes, but now I'm crash landed in the Andes. Eat my teammates starved. I'll be back in an hour. Crusty bulge. Oh, come on. <laughs> Is that a no? Yes, that's a no. Christy Bulge. These are not legitimate choices. Taylor thinks they are. Well, Taylor's wrong. The Dragonfly is a business. We need a, a credible street name. So oh, I'll tell Dragonfly you what we're Lane. Do. We're keeping Third Street. Taylor is not going to like that. Well, too bad, because that's what we're doing. Decision made. Am I disturbing? No, come on in. Rory, this is Edgar Pullings. He installed the to intercom. To fix the intercom? Nice to meet you. She said, nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you, young lady. Be shy. You all the I'm same guy. Short notice, but once I found him, I figured I better get him over here before he can he even can no, he even do anything? You. Everything else around here up to snuff? Mm -hmm. Are the sheets being over ironed? No. Edgar? 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 Oh my god, Is I need it. Birkin? Emergency the, BLT. Yeah. Emergency chili fries and black and white shake. It's a three alarm. The brand name? Something came for you early this morning. Good old Caesar signed up for it. Oh my God! You know, normally, I have a blanket policy against the diner. Find out what's going on in the girl's life. You most certainly don't talk to her boyfriend. Follow me. What? Where are you going? Follow me. Talk to Paris or Lane, Emily. or you she break home? in and no, sneak through her home. ship. Burst in here like this if she were home. We should not be here. This we're gonna prowling. snoop. We're not prowling, Richard. You can't prowl in your own house. This is called showing concern. Now tell me what we're looking for. Is it Emily? I, why would it, why would Emily be sending you this all this shit? I thought it was like she was sleeping, watching the channel, and the dog was accidentally buying it. No way! What the fuck? This is Emily? No way! This is Emily. Hello, I'm turning your bedroom into a gift wrapping room, and I have to get rid of your dollhouse. Do you want it forever? Call me the moment you work out your schedule. Oh, I will. The very moment. Oh, there's Emily. What the fuck? But she's what's what's she's, what the hell are these kids doing? Hey, yo! Get away from the urn. There's a kid in the urn. Really? Yes. He's very sorry about the confusion. He is. Put it yeah, together, Logan. You himself. And you're sure about this? I double super swear on my birth. So. I'm not gonna do that to you. Boy, that didn't come out right. It was supposed to sound a lot more. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like. Do you do you love her? I don't know. One antique bellows. Salvation Army. Wooden leather, brass studs. Wow. The dollhouse is here. Hello, Lorelai. Oh. Yeah. I thought you'd want this. Aw, look at that. Thanks, I do. And we need to talk about Rory. <sighs> we finished the episode with the thing I care about the most. Damn it. Damn it. Previously on. All right. Man, these episodes right now for me aren't going anywhere. <laughs> Like we we we're like slow playing the shit out of this season, and I you know I'm all for you know letting things breathe and slow playing it, but man, every episode I'm just kind of there like, so what happened? Did anything progress? The thing that progressed is the thing at the end that I'm most interested in that I want to see, but now I can't. Yeah. Yeah. Nonetheless, it was an okay episode. I don't know. It was fine. There was literally nothing that happened, really, besides the talk, I guess. What's going to happen is that Richard is going to talk to Lorelai. Because Richard is realizing Rory has no plan. This is Rory's life now. Her life is this. It's nothing. She has no plan. She has no plan to go back to school. She has no plan to go back to work. Lorelai told her that, or told Richard this a, long, a while ago about that. 
you know, is our plan working? Like, is anything progressing? And no, it's not. She's just accepting her life and the way it is. And I liked Richard's approach. It did come off like he was asking about our relationship and everything, but it, I did like his approach of saying, hey, man, what are we doing? What, it's like, well, what's, like, what's, you know, he wants to know what Rory's plans are. What is she doing? And I respect that. I respect that, that, um, I respect that he looks at it like, man, our plan to bring Rory in and everything isn't going to plan. Rory's just kind of living here. She's not doing anything. She's not traveling. She's not trying to figure out where her next career move is. She's not doing anything. She's just living her life, sleeping with Logan, dating Logan, and, and that's it. That's her life. So, and then Logan's reaction to shit. I don't understand Logan's how, how Logan like feels for Rory. I get he likes her a lot. And he loves and she loves him, she said. I don't know why. He is nice to her. He is a in the end, he is opening her up to different things. But I don't know. I just kind of feel like I I can't get a read on him as a like a person with her. Like I know he cares about her, but he still calls her ace. Which some people might think is cute. I don't know it is but then we also have the whole situation where Lorelai with the street names and then in the end we just stay with the shitty street names so nothing mattered in the end really we got stuff with, the, with Emily just giving shit away Emily being mean on purpose why why was Emily being such a pain in the ass and I said in the reaction, why was she being a bitch like you have a big ass house like insanely big ass house and you can't hold something until I can go get it. Like that's so fucked up. But yeah, overall, I don't know. The episode's fine. We're I, we're not, we're not progressing shit. The honestly, with some funny stuff, like with the breaking, like with the snooping and some of the Kirk stuff, the thing about the reason that Laura like kept the name was cause of, you know, Taylor with the tapping of the head and everything. But yeah, I don't know. Not, 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 not a lot here. So, that's the episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. I'm going to get out of here and talk to you guys later.